Conversation 1. Questions 1 through 4. Listen to a man asking a woman for directions. Can you tell me how to get to the music building from here? I have a lecture to attend there. Oh, are you new to campus? Yes, I just got here last night. Well, to get to the music building, you have two choices. If you want to go right now, you can walk straight down the street until you're past the commons, and then turn right. The music building will be straight ahead. How long will it take to get there? About 20 minutes. What's my other choice? If you don't mind waiting around for a while, you can take the shuttle bus. The bus only takes about five minutes to get there. But I have to wait for the bus? That's right. Well, I guess I might as well walk. Number one. Where does the man want to go? Number two. How many different routes to the music building does the woman suggest? Number three. What is the problem with taking the shuttle bus? Number four, what does the man finally decide to do? Conversation two, questions five through nine. Listen to a woman talk to a friend about her vacation. How was your trip to Wyoming last summer? It was fantastic. Some of the most beautiful scenery in the country is in Wyoming. Where did you go in Wyoming? We drove by Devil's Tower National Monument, and we spent a few days in Laramie. But we spent most of our vacation in Yellowstone National Park. You went to Yellowstone? I wish I could have gone. I've heard that Yellowstone is just magnificent. It's the oldest and largest national park in the United States. And it's got spectacular waterfalls, hot springs, and geysers. Did you see Old Faithful? Of course we saw Old Faithful. It's the best known of the geysers there. We couldn't visit Yellowstone without seeing Old Faithful. Do you think you'll be taking another vacation in Yellowstone again? If you do, I'd like to go next time. Number five. How does the woman describe her Wyoming vacation? Number six, how did the woman probably travel on vacation? Number seven, which of the following did the woman do on vacation? Number eight, which of the following is a well-known site in Yellowstone? Number nine, what would the man like to do? Conversation 3. Questions 10 through 13. Listen to a conversation between two friends. How are you going to spend this year's Thanksgiving vacation? I'm going to spend it with my family. We celebrate very traditionally. We go to my grandparents' house and have a big Thanksgiving dinner. It's really the only time in the year that my whole family gets together. In my family, we just have a big feast too. We don't really stop and think about how Thanksgiving Day developed, how new colonists in Massachusetts had a three-day feast to give thanks for surviving the first terrible winter and for gathering their first corn harvest the following year. 
Did you know that the original Thanksgiving Day was celebrated in July? No. I thought Thanksgiving had always been in November. The first Thanksgiving was celebrated on July 30th, 1623. After that, Thanksgiving was celebrated at many different times. It wasn't until 1863 that Abraham Lincoln declared the last Thursday in November as a day of Thanksgiving. And this holiday has been celebrated in November ever since. Number 10. What is the subject of this conversation? Number 11. How will the woman spend Thanksgiving? Number 12. What were the Massachusetts colonists thankful for? Number 13. According to the speaker, when is Thanksgiving celebrated today? This is the end of listening part B.